Here is my dilemma. I will be brief. So this is the result of the two-way factorial. Your first IV was AAQ with two levels, below medium and above median. The second IV was DHEQ. Same thing, below median, above median. So we got a two by two ANOVA. The, D, the DV here, the y-axis, is something called TSI. I have no idea what any of these means. But here is my dilemma. So this is the graph of the estimated marginal means, right? And it shows you know, interaction. But what the, what the professor wants on the person I'm working with, she wants it to look like this. And this is what I have been pulling my hair out, if I had any, over the last two days. I cannot figure out how to turn our graph, this graph, to tell if it's to, to like this one. She wants to know if the, the slopes of the line are significant or not. So let me go ahead and run the test and I'll, and I'll show you what I did. Radio. So here we go. A two by two factorial ANOVA with no repeated measures. Analyze general linear model univariato. And I think I already got them in there, right? That's the IV. There's the two fixed factors. And did I do that? Yes, I did. And get out of there. And I did this. So I've already done all these things. Okay. So here we go. Boom. So I know there's a significant interaction, right? And I tried everything to try to get the significance of the slope on there. I couldn't find it. Wasted hours and hours and hours. So let me show you what else I did. At first I thought I could do it by hand, right? The slope is simply the rise over the run, so the rise is easy. So like for the blue line, it's below medium for the AAQ guys. It went from roughly 4.25 up to 4.5 something, right? So that's the Y change, but there's no way to have an X change here, right? It goes from below median to above medium. That's not a one. I don't know what that number is. So I couldn't do it that way. So the second thing I thought of was a point by serial correlation between AAQ and the DV, and then a second one for the DHEQ and the DV. And I'll show you what they look like. Uh, analyze, correlate bivariate and look at that I already did one so there's the DHEQ and that would be the red line right DHEQ so that tells me that there you can expect a, a change going from the below medium DHQ to the high me above the median you can expect an increase of probably 0.181 okay and it is significant so then I did the second one. Let's do that one. Analyze. Correlate by a very get in there. You boom. And I change this guy with this one. So this would be the other line. And it gives me a negative 0.3. And that too is significant. So that would be the blue line, right? Yeah, that's this guy. So that what that tells me is that as you go from the below median for AAQ to above median for the DHQ, you would expect a uh, minus 0.303, okay? And that, too, is significant. So that's the first way I figured it out. I'm not sure that's right, though, okay? So, so are these both lines, the slopes here, significant? I am assuming so. So part B was I did a regression linear and I just used I used them one at a time so we're gonna do the AAQ here as the D as the IV and I know this isn't right but um, I got the same thing here right negative whoop, where is it right here for the coefficients right the beta weight is still the same negative 0 0.303 which is significant and then going the other way around, I did the, I switched it with the DHEQ and got the same number from the point by serial, which is what, one, 0 0.181. And where are you? No, 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 no. There it is, right there, right. So the beta weights are the same as the 
point by zero correlations. And they're both significant. So, but again, my problem is this. I don't know how to make it look like this on the graph. Is there something, is there a secret in SPSS that I don't know about? Or can I, you know, just take, put a, put a fake asterisk there and put they're both significant? I don't know how to do that in SPSS. So I hope that helps and I hope you can help me. All right. But thank you. MGZ out.